let's talk about a common overuse injury in the wrist. If you have pain at the base of your thumb that hurts with ulnar and radial deviation or kind of this little hand wiggle, then you might be suffering from de Quervain's tenosynovitis and all. That means is like, it's named after some orthopedic surgeon that named it, found it out, but it's basically inflammation in the tendons at the base of the thumb. A lot of times we see that in our population, you know, maybe they go on a long skiing trip and it's like that motion, or it's also in our moms, you know, people or caregivers that are constantly picking up young kids. It's a lot of this. Um, and in the short term, that can just kind of lead to an overuse injury. So we like to start, we just have to protect these, whether that's with a brace, maybe taped for support, limit aggravation at that to decrease the inflammation. Maybe we do use some over-the-counter anti-inflammatories or ice. And then as we get back into the activity, we have to limit any overuse. And we also can add in, I like to use this TheraBar. This is super helpful for wrists and elbow complaints, but if you kind of grab it like this, if you get one of these on Amazon, and then we can kind of strengthen up this and back and nice, slow and controlled with both the bent elbow. We can do a straight elbow and then we can kind of flip it the other way to kind of work both concentric and eccentric. But if you have a good test for it, the orthopedic test that most people talk about is called Finkelstein's where you kind of put your thumb in your palm, wrap your fingers around it and then you kind of take it out and bend it down. So if you see like putting, you'll feel some stress through there. And in a super inflamed tendon, you'll get a lot of symptoms. So a lot of times these respond conservatively to just bracing anti-inflammatories and a little exercise. And in the cases that they don't, honestly, uh, a steroid injection right in there is super, super helpful. So this is a common overuse injuries. We see it in our active adult population, whether they're going on a skiing trip, taking care of young kids, this can cause irritation in that area. The only other thing we have to be careful of is if you've fallen, like it's kind of, you know, we're in the winter time here, falling on the outstretched hand, there's a bone that kind of sits in what's called that anatomical snuff box, and that's called your scaphoid bone. We have to make sure that that's not fractured. So we don't really see de veins in a trauma case. We have to be thinking fracture, but if it's an overuse injury, um, skiing, caregiving, et cetera, then we're thinking de veins. We're thinking it's the most common overuse injury in kind of this area at the base of your thumb. So, you know, you can test yourself at home with a little Finkelstein's and then kind of brace it, take it easy. We can obviously help with some rehab and some hands-on treatment, but that's what it is and that's what we're seeing in the clinic. So we wanted to put out a video for you to kind of treat it at home, diagnose it, and let us know if you need it. Omni Chiropractic, providing solutions to pain and performance.